Hey, what's up everybody? It's Minecraft Friday and I'm here jumping for joy because why? I have so much to show you guys. I've built so many new things and I've updated stuff. I just can't wait to show you. Uh, one of the first things I've done is updated all the doors with uh, the pressure doors. You just walk through it like that if you get it right the first time. There you go. Um, you just hit the, hit the switch and walk through it. Whoa, what's this? I'll show you guys that in a minute. Now, I outfitted the entire place with glowstone just because I was tired of creepers, just creepers and the zombies and the, and the uh, skeletons popping up and spawning here. They spawn if you have lots of stone and they spawn if it's not well lit. And that's what I found out. So I had to put a bunch of stone down because they kept blowing up the floor, destroying the floor. Corey's room was obliterated and downstairs underneath was all blown to shreds. Um, Here's Andy's room. I haven't put the doors on yet because I'm going to show you guys how easy it is. If you're wondering like how the pressure doors work in Minecraft, uh, they're fairly easy. So I have the iron door, then you grab yourself a button, and you just like slap a door there, slap a door there, button, button, and that's it. Like, you're good to go. So let me show you Cory's room. I fixed it. The floor is no longer blown to bits. As you can see, the floor is intact. Cory's room has been lowered for some reason. What's the reason? I'll, sh I'll show you guys. So the ceiling's been lowered in here as well. I'll show you guys why. Um, I also outfitted down here with tons of glowstone because this is where all the creepers were spawning. They're all spawning in here. And they would walk up the stairs and then blow up this entire floor. So, you know, when we first built this castle, we didn't know. We were just playing Minecraft for the first time and just playing on creative mode. And we so we built this entire castle, Corey and I. There's a video on that. And we really didn't know the rules or like know Minecraft all too well. So um, everything has been updated here. Uh, doors as well for here. A glowstone, glowstone everywhere, blocking stuff off because people kept spawning down here. Ooh, the cow laid an egg. Just kidding. It was probably one of the chickens. And I put doors down here in the mine that goes down into the world. You guys know about that mine. Um, there's videos on everything I've done in this game if you're really unfamiliar with what's going on all the videos are here everything's been done and recorded on video so if you're really lost feel free to check out all the past Minecraft Friday videos so that's just here now that was just a quick update on the house the house um, on the inside I, I will say um, let me show you guys what I've done on the top of the house Ooh, what's this this is the reason why Corey's room was lowered. Now, if you've ever been to um, San Luis Obispo County in California, there's a pool in this really big fancy house in this place called Hearst Castle. Now, this pool has flooring made of gold, and like golden golden flakes are inlaid in tile. Really, really fancy. Look it up on Google. Just type in Hearst Castle. Uh, William Randolph Hearst used to live there. Uh, I'll go and I don't want to go into his history. There's tons of history on the dude. Anyway, made a pool, gold flooring. Uh, this is the deep end, so if you want to go for a dive, you don't crack your head wide open. And then over here is you know the shallower end. Maybe I'll raise this a little bit so it's not so crazy, just all of a sudden just really deep. But when we were looking in and all that blue stuff was there, here's the here's the castle. Here's the inside. So if I'm swimming in here and say Corey walks up, well, he'll just see me swimming. And I also put a wall in Andy's room so she can see into the pool as well. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. Now, why did I make a pool here? Why did I make a pool? Let me show you guys. I got rid of the stairway that led to this to this area up here. I got I got rid of the, uh, the railway. You remember that? There was a railway system that was just randomly over here. It was a big mess and it looked really ugly because I didn't know how to build very well. We've gotten a little bit better. I made a spiral uh, railway upwards to the sky house. So let's take a ride, shall we? Whoop, yep. Let's grab a cart. That's a dirt block. There we go. So we got a cart. Huzzah! Let's go on up, guys. To the spiral stairway. Ooh, this is fancy. Ooh, this is fun. And we're here. Let's break that. No one needs that. Now, we're up here at the stairway. You're like, whoa. Oh, yeah. That thing? I'll show you what that is later. So why did I build a pool? Let me show you guys. 
So say you're up here at the Sky House, you're just chilling, having a good time, which I've now extended this room into a cool loft so you can see over the clouds. And you're just like, oh man, it's such a beautiful day. It's so pretty outside. Well, what's this? It's, it's open here? I'm going to close that. On second thought, maybe I shouldn't close it. Maybe I want to go for a jump. And going for a dive. Into the pool, guys. Let me fly out of here. I can't swim. Uh. Oh, what this thing is? That'll be a whole other video. I don't want to spoil anything for you guys, but that'll be a whole other video. I know you're like, what's that big green thing? Yeah. Next video, I promise next week, I will show you guys what that is because holy smokes. Anyway. Oh, I hear sirens. Someone's in trouble. So, a few videos back, a commenter by the name of Lions or Boss 54 left a comment about a pattern I did. And his comment, I'm assuming it's a guy, I'm very sorry if you're a girl, but I'm, mostly guys watch my gameplays. Uh, Lions or a Boss, Lions or Boss 54 said that the pattern was off. And it was great constructive criticism because it totally was off. So, I completely updated the Creeper House. Let's go take a look at it. So, before we take a look at the creeper house, there's that one house in the corner where Corey, Andy, and I did that large build. I can't look to my left because that other house that I built is there. I want to show you guys that in another video. Spoilers. So, um, before we get to the creeper house, here's the house that Corey, Andy, and I built. Outfitted it with the same doors. There's no button on this door. How am I going to get inside, Mike? I didn't think of that, did I? Um, let's do a button right here. Okay. Whoops. <laughs> Funny. Anyways, uh, the inside was just blue carpet and it was empty. This is still relatively empty. I just really don't know what to put in here. But here's a table. Uh, I'm going to see a table. Table dance. Uh, table dance. Can't, can't dance on the table, I guess. Roof's too low. Whatever. So put up some, uh, some artwork. You know, some armor artwork. The floor is glowstone, so it's all well, well, nice and lit in here. And then I put up some artwork in this room because I feel like it just needs to display some amazing artwork. I can't spawn this art piece anymore. I've tried to do it in my room because I really like this piece. It looks really creepy, but it's just only in here, I guess. Maybe you only get one in this, in this game. I don't know what that's about. Anyway, here are some beds. Yep, that's that room needs more stuff in it it's really big and uh, here's upstairs you guys remember upstairs I put a little farm in here and I don't know where the pig came from because I actually had a couple horses but now it's just one horse left in here so I don't know where the other ones went however this pig I don't know where the pig came from <laughs> maybe this spawned here maybe it spawned that's fine I don't, I'm fine with that but here's some hay for this horse Ooh, he's all happy and stuff cool all right, so that's this house all updated. Uh, I needed to put decorations in because it was just so empty. All right, guys, so on the way to the Creeper House, newly updated Creeper House, came up to show you guys this. The last part of today's uh, tour, I will say. Oh, Creeper Alley. Whoa, what are all these colors? Anyone sick? <laughs> all right, so let's back away from the Creeper House. You ready? Dun dun dun! Yes, I fixed it. The pattern is way more correct this time, and I gave the creeper eyes. So when you move moving side to side, it looks like the eyes are kind of following you almost. I don't know. I think they are. I maybe I'm just really weird, but I like him. Uh, I just put the glowstone in just further deep into the eye socket, so it looks like it's kind of following you. The same pattern as the creeper is. So when you're going down the alleyway, it just looks like these crazy colors. And it did. It looked crazy. You guys saw this house updated. Um, just changed the uh, rim of the house. Gave it a darker wood. Kind of decorated the inside of this place. You guys saw the updated sky house. Flying high. Here we go. The updated sky house with the new added porch that goes to... The amazing Hearst Castle inspired gold inlaid swimming pool. Let's just fall. Wee! And then the house has been updated on the inside. All new doors. Fixed up the room so that way there's no more creepers 
or zombies or skeletons or spiders spawning inside the house when I'm just walking around my own place I don't get killed it happens every time almost or the floor get blown up but that's whoop can't I mess up there so that's the update guys I hope you liked it new stuff nice and fixed I'm enjoying it thank you guys for watching today's episode Stay tuned next week for what in the heck that big green thing was outside over there in that direction. I uh, can't wait to show you guys what that thing is. It took a little while to build. I'm very excited to show it off. Until next next time, well, I can't even speak. Until next time, guys, see you next Friday, Minecraft Friday. Happy gaming.